Plant or animal species that move from their historical range are a force of ecological and evolutionary change. The Marine Invasions Lab at CERC hopes to understand patterns, processes, and consequences of invasive species of plants and animals. One way that the Marine Invasions Lab tracks fallen communities is by deploying PVC plates that hang off of docks and marinas. Over time, fallen communities populate on these plates. We then pull up the PVC plates, photograph them, and identify all of the organisms that have grown on the plates. A plate is actually a square PVC panel that we've cut and drilled holes into, and we've attached to a brick. So this brick will hang off of a dock underwater for about three months. And the panels are where the photos are taken. So we'll take a photo from this part and, you'll, and things will settle on this while it's in the water. Because our scientists can't be everywhere at once, we use the help of citizen scientists to help collect data. This is what Plate Watch is. Plate Watch involves groups and classrooms to deploy their own plates. Citizen scientists pull up plates and take photos of them to send to our scientists for identification. Unfortunately, that creates quite a backlog of photos for our scientists to go through and identify. So we're trying a new method to identify invertebrates on plates on a platform called Zooniverse. So Zooniverse is our new project. We haven't ever done it before, and it's our, our way of trying to get more people to help us through your computers. Instead of going to classrooms, we're gonna have people do it in their own homes, do it on their own computers, on their own laptops, and just take our photos and get, give you a kind of brief introduction into what a marine invertebrate is, and then you could help us identifying species. Zooniverse allows citizen scientists all over the world to contribute to different research projects. The project is still in development and going through testing, but we'll let you know when we have more news to share. We would like to thank all of the citizen scientists who have helped deploy plates, take photographs, and those who have participated in the first steps of testing our Zooniverse project. We could not do the work we do without you.